Welcome Central Michigan Lacrosse fans. We are here at the Central Michigan Lacrosse Complex in Mount Pleasant, Michigan for this Mid-Americans Conference matchup between our Central Michigan Chippewas and the Golden Flashes of Kent State University. Not being down at half. If they're down at half once again and that one will score. That was Natalie Harlan with it. That is her 48th goal of the season. She is now just two goals away from that magical number 50. Prince coming in, shot there, and that one finds the back of the net. And that'll be number eight, Tyra Prince, putting the Chippewas up now three to two. Harlan with it, moving in, makes a move, shot there, and she scores. So that'll put her at 49 goals on the season as long as she passes the quick stick check there. Dybul coming in, hovers around that 12 meter line once again. Now inside the eight, shot there, and she finds the back of the net. 19-14 to go in this first period. Chippewas now up five to four. Who's that to Chong Ahmed? Chong Ahmed rips a shot, and that one will get past the goaltender. And Chong Ahmed will pick up her first goal of the day here with 12.25 to go in this first period. Burke back out to Carlin, shot there, and that's number 50 on the season there by Natalie Carlin with the assist coming from Courtney Burke. 8.29 to go in this first period of play. Chip moving it in now, shot there by Whiteside, and she'll find the back of the net once again with 7.59 to go in the first period. Chippewas now lead 11 to six. That is Brandt over to Carlin. Carlin moving around the top of the net, trying to get that shot on goal, and she got the ball in the net, but a flag will come out of that official's pocket, and that goal will not count, I believe. And they just signal that it will. So Chippewas now up 13 to six in this one. Pulls it to the net, chips that one to Wagnon. Picked off there, shot there, scores. That'll be number 30, McKenna Hoon for the Chippewas. Carlin carries in, flings that one over. Shot there by Diebold, and she'll find the back of the net as well. That'll be her second goal of the game here. And with 8.04 to go in this second period, Chippewas back to a double-digit lead as they now lead 19-9. And that'll do it here from Mount Pleasant. Central Michigan takes the win against Kent State by a score of 19-9. Just a stellar offensive and defensive performance from the Chippewas.